Hello! In this module, we will learn about Canadian copyright. What we will learn today is the definition of copyright, how a work is protected by copyright, and what is protected by copyright and what is not protected by copyright. According to the Canadian Copyright Act, copyright can be defined as the sole right to produce or reproduce the work or any substantial part thereof or any material form whatever. Wait, what does that even mean? Basically, this means that you have the right to copy, use, and or create content following certain conditions found under the Canadian Copyright Act. The purpose of the Copyright Act is to balance the rights of users and creators. You might be wondering, how does a work become protected by copyright? Well, copyright protection in Canada is automatic if the work is original and fixed. What original means is that it must be it must come from the creator. It cannot be copy a copy of another work. The creator must use skill, expertise, labor, taste, discretion, selection, judgment, personal effort, knowledge, ability, reflection, and imagination. Quite the list. Fixed refers to the form that the work is presented in. Basically, fixed format refers to a work that is written down on paper, saved to a computer, recorded, videotaped, or painted on canvas. Remember, even if a work does not have the copyright symbol, it is still protected under the Copyright Act. So you might be wondering, what is, co what is, copyright, what is a copyright protected work? Well, arti artistic creations such as drawings, engravings, paintings, and photographs like our example here of a painting by Emily Carr. Computer digital material like clip art, computer programs, databases, emails, blogs, wikis, and websites, like our example of Flickr website. Dra dramatic creations, including radio and television shows, films, plays, and musicals, like our example of the movie Moon. literary creations such as books, magazines, pamphlets, and newspapers, like our example of the book The Wars by Timothy Finley, and musical creations such as arrangements, adaptions, sound recordings, and sheet music. Here we have an example of sheet music. So, what's not covered by copyright? Generally, Facts, ideas, and works in the public domain are not covered by copyright. For example, the laws of thermodynamics, the plot line for a story, or an idea for a new line of research are not copyrightable. But the text, storyboard, or research proposal that sets out your particular expression of those ideas are subject to copyright. To recap, today we learned the definition of copyright. How, to, how a work is protected by copyright, and what is protected by copyright, and what is not protected by copyright. Thanks for listening.